Hi, I'm Sylvie, and this is my friend and partner, Claudia. We're both serious plant lovers and can't get enough of them. I mean, we really love plants, and we do everything we can to keep them happy. But plants are difficult and demanding creatures. No matter how hard we try, they keep dying on us. Something tragic. Now, how do you keep them alive? Since we don't speak the same language, they can't tell us directly what they need. So we needed to find other ways to connect and came up with another solution. Meet the Fita Beam. The Fita Beam is a smart plant sensor that gives plants a voice. It measures soil's moisture, light intensity, the air temperature, and even the soil nutrition levels around your plant. The Beam works with our Fita app, which we jointly built with experienced plant scientists. The app compares the measurements from the Beam with plant-specific data in our database and notifies you whenever your plant needs something. It literally gives your plant a voice. But the app is much more than just an operating device for the sensor. It's a fun tool to learn more about plants. It will offer you tutorials and other content which will inspire you to take your plant love to the next level. Over time, you will learn to understand your plant without even needing the device. For those of you who travel a lot, we have developed the Fita Base. The base connects with the beams via Bluetooth and extends the connectivity range of the beams through Wi-Fi. This will help you keep an eye on your plant while you're away. We started working on the beam over a year ago. Besides developing a highly functional sensor, we wanted to make sure that it is sustainable. We built in a solar cell that supports the battery, and every piece of the sensor can be detached, customized, and separately recycled. But in order to get where we are, we had to go through several iterations. Our first prototypes looked like this, or this, until we produced a functioning prototype. We have already successfully calibrated and tested the prototypes, and the hardware development is now complete. To finish the last mile, we need your help. In order for the Fita Beam to see the light, we need funds to finance the molds in the first batch. And while the funds are important to us, we're mostly interested in your feedback on how we can improve the beam. Be part of our community and connect with plants.